Hey guys, welcome back, Rob here at RS. And the last couple of weeks we've been really busy with the Y-Wing helmets, the first wave, getting that complete, getting it shipped. And although we've not talked about it, we've also been working, as ever, on other projects. One of them I'd like to update on today is the Boba Fett helmet run, the lineage casting. Um, as you can see behind me, we've got an awful lot of helmet castings ready for paint, which are in white. And we've got an awful lot of helmet castings in the dark grey colour. Now, if you're watching this and you're on the run, you should have had an email regarding the colour and some of the bits and bobs and details and information that we need to complete. What I can tell you at this stage is, the castings have come out amazing. I couldn't be happier. Well, I just couldn't be happier. They are the perfect. Absolutely perfect. And exactly the way we knew they would be when we planned this. Most of it's down to Sean, Laminator Man and Boy. One huge step forward that we're about to take is next week, Sean is back with us here in the studio after a long absence due to working at home because of the COVID pandemic. But he is back and we have got new moulds being made. I think we've made about 20 pulls, 20 casts, something like that out of the moulds, he's away at the moment, we're refreshing the moulds, he's going to come back to brand new moulds and we're going to go again for a second bite of the cherry and to complete the runoff. By the time we have all the components to complete the kit, which is the ears, the topper, the stalk, the chin strap, the visor, most of them we've got, some of the little bits we've not got yet, it's all in hand, they'll be here very soon. We're talking a couple of weeks, I think. I'm going to be ready to ship this out. I cannot wait. I'll be, I'm really excited for people to get these in their hands and give us some feedback because I know they're amazing. I think it'll silence a few critics when we get this out. I cannot wait. Super exciting. Always love to do this. As ever, it's a team effort. John's cracking on with the paint. We've got the castings. We've got other bits and pieces that are being done in the background. Um, but that's it. I mean, I mean, one of the one of the big things that we wanted to discuss in this video was the final colour of the raw castings. As you can see, we've got the nice dark grey castings. They pick up all the detail and they look amazing. They look fantastic. I'm really happy with how they've come out. And um, watch this space. It's a very fast moving project it's a very fast moving run when it comes to the the raw castings as far as the painted ones go it's going to take some time so please be patient bear with us i'm sure it's going to be worth the wait because they're coming out looking fantastic but i mean it's an intricate paint job there's over 40 hours of paint involved in creating one of these helmets i'm sure you can appreciate something like this can't be rushed and needs the artist to do his thing Everything is going as I have foreseen. And um, yeah, that's just a simple update. Um, come back next time because I think we've got the next part of our origin story. Andrew's shaking his head here because he knows that's not going to happen. But come back next week and see who's going to be right. I'm actually here because there's nothing happened. I'm shaking it now because it's got to happen. Exactly. And what will happen is you might have one of your paddies and start smashing TVs again. I don't have paddies or smash TVs. Monitors. I might smash monitors. <laughs> Come back next time and catch up and refresh yourself with everything that's happening here in the studio. From a very hot and sweaty Manchester studio. Until next time, 